Hello, I'm back. My name's Fluttershy. No, it's Markida. Oh, yes. <laughs> I am Fluttershy at heart. With a, with a pinch of rainbow. A pimp. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And a pinch yeah. of energy as well. Darling. <laughs> to me, I'm Rainbow Dash, Applejack, and all the stuff I need to like. Um, Spitfire. Yeah, Starlight. <laughs> today, we're going to tell you about the CD I got today. Oh, Yes, you know anything about the CD? I told you, haven't I? You did. The well, thing is, peoples. <laughs> the the thing is, though, I'm at home now, though. You are at home, yes. <laughs> that's why me being Markida, I got mm-hmm. the ho- at home CD music Yay. CD. Here we got Michelle Cueva, Apple Blue, <laughs> <laughs> Apple Blue, Black Griffin, or. Gabe. Gabriel Brown. Yes. Gabriel Brown. Angela Libman. Fluttershy. <laughs> Michael Creeper. And Monique Creeper. And that's just had an interesting thought. Who does Monique Creeper represent in Elements of Harmony? I just thought about that, but no. We, because when you see Angela Lipman, you immediately think of Fluttershy or Pinkie Pie. When it comes to the Gable, I see him as a Fluttershy fan. Black Griffin? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Well, apparently he said that his best penny was uh, Rainbow Dash. That could be true because the amount of the amount of ventures is he's done. Yeah. Like not everyone can go fall off a um a bridge and skydive. <laughs> yeah, that's bungee <laughs> jumping. <laughs> oh, don't oh, I'll I'll put it past him. We we do um skydiving. Mm, do for charity? Probably not. <laughs> but you might say yes because it's the same sort of thrill, thrill ride. Well, yeah, yeah, he would say yes, but I wouldn't say yes. <laughs> you it's get a lot of risk. You get lots, of, lots of risk of everything in life. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna go through the track um listings. Um, number one is adventure. Woo! Woo! I like that song. Woo-hoo. Uh, that's the tune I use, isn't it? I think that's the tune yeah. I use. Number two is Sunny Gets Blue. Number three is Return to Pooh Corner. <laughs> what? Well, I said Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> <laughs> Winnie the, <laughs> the Pooh. Um, number four is In My Dreams. Yeah. That's Monique Creeper. Number five is Over the Rainbow. I think I've heard that from her. Uh, yes. Um, she, um, I remember watching one of her videos and it was a stage concert. Well, yes, it uh, was. Yeah, um, over the rainbow. And I think uh, the dog was actually Michelle's dog. And it happened to be the right breed. Yeah, roundabouts, <laughs> yeah. Um, Close enough. <laughs> number six is Girl from... I can't pronounce the name. I really yeah, can't. I can't pronounce the name. <laughs> I can't. It's L-P-A-N-E-M-A. Number five is A Song For You. Mm-hmm. Oh, is it for me, Apple Bloom? Number eight will be... I will fight for you. Number nine is Love or Bye from Michelle. Yeah, Michelle. By M- Michael Creeper. Yeah. Because Michael's usually the keyboard player. And this next track we actually heard at British Bronicorn. It is. I be hu- I be there. But I... Andrea Lipman wasn't there. No, even though it should have been an Andrew Lipman's tune. Yeah. It was all that tune, but there was one person. A uh, relaxing unplug collection of originals and uncovers. Un- Word of warning if you planning to buy the CD, at least in UK, um, expect to pay VAT and handling charges when it gets yeah. to UK. Um, I I came in that cross I came across that um last week and it's about twelve pounds. Just make yeah. sure if you want to buy the C D you're gonna get you might get so subject to fees. We can open up the C D. We got two mark. Oh wow. You got Michelle Creeper oh, bit blurry there. No no, no, it's, I can see it. Uh, Black yeah. Griffin. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> well Michael. Angela Angela Libben couldn't sign it, maybe because she was busy or something. Maybe if, when I go if Mich- uh, if she comes from the comes one day, I say, since you weren't there on the day, can you sign this for us? Yeah. He seems to be hiding Fluttershy. <laughs> <laughs> I know you're Fluttershy, but, you know, you can be brave. You're Cloudy Quartz, for goodness sake. Piggy Pie's mother. <laughs> oh, boy. 
and uh, I would show you what I got from the Great British Brownie Con in Manchester. I got Black Griffins or Gabriel Brown's Immortal album. Oh yes, um, I know they they the made uh, the artwork in ink shape. I think. Yeah. And it's also signed, if you can see it, by Black Griffin and Michelle Cleaver. Just imagine if I order it online, how much the fees I've got to pay. Oh, gosh. How much did you pay? How much did you pay? How, do you, how much did you pay? Um, well, the CD cost pounds. How much? How much? But sorry? the ten pounds. Uh, right, right. But it cost an extra tenner for the autographs. So it was twenty pounds altogether. That's about the same price if you order it online. Yeah. Subject to... If you do it online, you're subject to... You're paying Lily thirty dollars worth. In okay. a sense, when they bring the CDs or when they bring the, their music to UK, you're basically having a saving. Okay. You're not because you're not paying for the shipping cost. Yeah, I'm, I'm not paying for the shipping cost because the CDs are actually there. Yeah, and you're not paying for any import fees. No. 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 Uh, I really want to play a track now. Uh, yeah. It's between Adventure. I'll be there. I used I am um, Adventure when I was doing the green screen effect. <laughs> yeah, that's going to book. I do remember just standing at the background while they were doing stuff. <laughs> I do I do like this track. When I first heard it, I loved it. Uh, this tune is special to me because this is the, one of the first tunes I used when I was going to park. Because I was talking about going on the venture. Mm-hmm. The venture's finished, but the journey still continues. Woo. Yes. And now, let's sit back and relax. Talk if you want to. Adventure. By Black Griffin and Michelle Creeper. Michelle Creeper. It's a shame that Michelle Creeper wasn't in um, Lipless Pet Shop when she had the chance. Yeah. Should have made a great pet. <laughs> Now this was filmed in the Grand Canyon in Arizona. Which is not far from Michigan. No, Grand Ca- no, 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 don't mean that. Grand Canyon. This is a bit south, really. There, that's what I was talking about. Oh, a bunch of jumps. Yeah, <laughs> you! Wee. Especially doing it backwards. Oh, come on! <laughs> <laughs> or do you have to do a bungee? Or do you have to bungee backwards? I might be best doing that way. It must be very windy that day then. Mm. Uh, what uh, Black Griffin does in his concerts is that backflip. Like I thought! <laughs> Out of the blue! <laughs> and it became very popular. But that, that's his trademark thing when he does concerts. Yeah, yeah. He usually does backflips. It's like a I was there sort of. Yeah. It's funny though, when, when I see Michelle Creeper singing, I just picture Apple Bloom. <laughs> yes! Go on an adventure. 
It's just the first thing. It just, it just comes to my head when I see them. It comes a bit difficult when the. Yeah, it was very windy that day. It was adventure. It's a very good song, that. Yeah. It comes very difficult when it comes to like Andrew Lipman. Who do you see more of? Pink Pie or Fluttershy? Or Coco Pernell for that matter? Uh, Coco Pernell was actually Kathy Westlock. Oh, Kathy Westlock. Yes. Even Kathy Westlock, she's played so many... Oh, has she ever? <laughs> and she's played so many ponies and pets. Well, one yeah, pet, yeah. actually. But... Uh, don't get me... Don't even got Tara Strong. Gosh. Tara Strong. So many voices for her. <laughs> <laughs> and Tabitha St. Germain. Tabitha St. Germain. So many voices for her as well. <laughs> yeah. Loads of voices. She voices my favourite princess, Princess Luna. And she plays a dog. A talking dog. A talking skunk. <laughs> <laughs> and a, yes, as well. And a talking dog, Martha. Martha speaks, yes. Yes. Well, she's Martha herself. Yes. And she's a, she plays a comedian skunk called Pepper. Pepper. Pepper Clark. And also, one of my favourite characters. Yes. Hey, Minka Mark. He's played by Kira Tozar. Did Brian Drummond as well play in Pet Shop as well? Yeah, she, he played a, um, a mongoose called Shirook. Shirook. Was yeah. that the only pl time he came in? I'm sure he did others, but yeah. can't name them all. <laughs> <laughs> if you want to know the full list, look at INDB. Or maybe Wikipedia. <laughs> maybe Wikipedia. If you type Brian Drummond's name, it may... And she has, he has a daughter. Oh, yes. Uh... Brian Drummond, who plays... I think we should see more of her. Yeah, but I think it was hard trying to get catch that accent of New York. No, nah, it's not that hard. Voice is quite easy. Yeah, but when we say New York accent, are there so? Is it like London with so many different dialects of New York? I think there are some dialects. Yeah, dialects of New York. But, yeah. Uh, one uh, with voiced is more of a. Um, I think it's the. Don't quote me on it, but I think it's the Brooklyn, Bronx area. Yeah, when especially when you said, "Watch where you're traveling, buddy." <laughs> What's where you're traveling, buddy? That is a New York, um, accent. Hey, I'm walking here. <laughs> <laughs> and who voiced that? Uh, Peter. Peter New. Yeah. And that was in my vlog. <laughs> and that's it. Yeah, the angry motorist. <laughs> yeah. I'm trotting here. That's it where that. Also, it was also one of the staff in Zeruk's film, apparently. I didn't notice my letter fell down. As well as. It was also one of the staff in. Jerusalem's film, apparently. I didn't notice my letter fell down. <laughs> Neither did I. <laughs> <laughs> we got so caught up in the room about My Little Pony Pet Shop and other characters. There's rumours about, not rumours, but are we hoping that Michelle Creeper and, and Black Griffin may be going to a certain con. Mm. Maybe, but nothing's been confirmed yet. Yes. No pony knows. But I think I think it is rumour, but I, I really hope it's true. <laughs> I really hope it's true, but it could be true not. or not be not, not true. Mm. And if you haven't noticed, Michelle Creeper, if you happen to watch this video, please come to Leeds! If you haven't noticed, uh, Michelle Creeper, the artwork I got you to sign for me is behind me! Hanging on your door! Yeah, and Peter knew it's that way. Well, behind me, yeah. there, there, there. I just need Angela Lippin, then she can sign my 
poster. Or even... The looting. That's a shy. If I had the chance, I might get this signed. <laughs> the t-shirt. <laughs> yeah. Then it will be... It's not too much money. It's only about $15. Well, plus the, you know, the shipping. Um, It wasn't as bad as certain sites. Okay. Okay. Um, Especially if you like the shirt so much, you wouldn't mind buying a new one. Yeah. Because I want to get a new one. Maybe Apple Bloom? What, CMC's? <laughs> Mm. Apple Flail, yeah. Mm, CMC's or Apple Bloom, that's the main thing. Well, if the rumour's true, Apple Bloom. If the rumour's not true... CMC's. CMC's because... I want... We're all in it together. <laughs> yeah, I want a different shirt. We won't go to, we won't go to the next con. I do like the shirt, I do like the Rebbe Dash shirt, but... Yeah, you need another one. I need a, I need a change. Yeah. Yeah. There are other characters like Applejack. Twilight, Rarity. <laughs> the thing is, if if I got the other shirts, if I got shirts of the main six, I'd rather have them all, all in all one. Together. All together. Yeah. Then I'm not representing just one character. Yeah, you're representing all of them. Yeah. I'm not saying all of my favourite, but I'm not, I don't, I don't, I don't, I like, I like them all, but there's some, some characters, maybe not my top top favourite in the main six in the main six yeah. because it was Fluttershy first and Rainbow Dash and I would put Twilight Sparkle next yeah it's like that in my head it's like um, yeah a war between Rainbow Dash and Applejack yeah Rainbow Dash is my favourite but Applejack wants to push her away <laughs> yeah and <laughs> it, the favorite. it's a bit difficult when it comes to Applejack and Rarity, because not everyone likes the Rarity. No, because she's like whiny and, and whiny and Applejack. <laughs> if you lift, I'm sorry, I'm just saying, if you lift on the farm, you're more declined to go for Applejack. Yeah. Yeah. Country. Yeah. If you're, I I can't speak country. I can speak a bit country. <laughs> <laughs> May not be the best at it, but you know, ain't too bad. <laughs> okay, I want to say thank you very much. Um. Michelle Creeper, Black Griffin, Andrew Lipman, Michelle Creeper, and Moni Creeper for the Michael, TV. Michael, Michael Creeper, yeah. and Moni Creeper. Yeah. And I like the CD. Will I buy the CD again? Yes, I will. But bear in mind, I need to make sure I've got the cash for the fees. Yeah. It's very important. I might, might I add that thank you very much, Black Griffin, for this CD. Oh, yes. With... Uh, Michelle Kreber included on it. And may I say that your brother's intro for Faster Than You Know is brilliant. That's a good tune. It's brilliant. That it's is a brilliant. good tune. That is a good yeah. tune, yeah. Such a great intro on that song. Well, this has been Mark Ida for a little... Well, I don't know how long we'll be going for, but... This has been Mark Ida about... Um, the, the at home CD. Um, I leave a link to the site where you can buy this and what songs I use on the tune or in the in the show. Yeah. Um, do you want to say goodbye, Thomas? Uh, I like to say goodbye in an apple bloom voice if you don't mind. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it may not be the best at it, but I, I'm working on it. And I could, I just noticed, I could see the apple bloom poster. Oh yeah, it's uh, right there. There she is. And that was that was a colouring book, yeah? Well it was a colouring sheet, but we yeah. did for fun, yeah. Alright, and I will see you later on in another video. Oh, oh yes. yes.